Hi guys. Welcome to my channel. So before we get started make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe my channel. In this video we will talk about Top 10 places to visit in Finland. So make sure to watch the full video. 1 Helsinki As the country's capital, Helsinki is the most popular place to visit in Finland and a destination you won't want to miss. If Helsinki looks a lot like St. Petersburg, it is because it was built to replicate the Russian city style in 1812. Today, some of the main attractions in Helsinki include the many churches, the three most important of which include the Lutheran Cathedral, the Church in the Rock and the Uspinski Cathedral. The stadium that served as the site of the 1952 Olympics is worth a visit, as is the Art Deco architecture of the Parliament House. While there are dozens of excellent museums and galleries in Helsinki, one of the best to see is the National Museum of Finland, which does a great job of tracing Finnish history over time. 2. Rovaniemi If you want to experience the beauty of Lapland, then Rovaniemi is the ultimate gateway to it all. The capital of Finnish Lapland, Rovaniemi was completely destroyed at the end of the Second World War. As a result, much of the architecture is mid-century and brutalist in design. While Rovaniemi is home to a number of wonderful attractions, a highlight is undoubtedly that it serves as the official Finnish home to Santa Claus. Visitors can tour Santa Claus Village, get stamps from the Santa Claus Post Office and even visit the Santa-themed underground amusement park. None Christmas attractions in Rovaniemi include the Korundi House of Culture, the Pilk Science Center and the engineering feat known as the Jack Kankanala Bridge. The world-famous Angry Birds Park is a recreational and activity hub that is designed with the theme of the Angry Birds. The swings, slides, rides, and rope walk in this park are crafted in regards with the popular Angry Birds characters. Spacious enough to also offer ball games, this stunning open-air playground lies at a walking distance from Rovaniemi city center. 3. Savonlinna A small city in the heart of Finnish Lakeland, Savonlinna is a charming historic destination worth a visit on your next trip to Finland. Located in the middle of Lake Seima on a series of islands, the area's biggest attraction is unquestionably Olavinlinna, or St. Olaf's Castle, which was built in the 15th century. Since the castle's location wasn't militarily or politically important for centuries, it has withstood the test of time and remains largely intact and furnished. Also worth checking out in Savonlinna is the Orthodox Museum, the Savonlinna Provincial Museum and nearby Karamaki, where the world's biggest wooden church is located. In Savonlinna's Market Square, be sure to dig into Moiku, or a local herring dish, from one of the many vendors in the area. What would a trip to Finnish Lakeland be without spending some time in a lakeside cabin? You'll typically need to drive a bit further out of town to find there, but it's totally worth the effort. Just about all these cabins come with a wood fireplace, and wood sauna, keeping you warm all year round. 4. Porvo The second oldest town in all of Finland is Porvo, a destination known for its unique and picturesque wooden homes. As you stroll through the cobblestone streets of Old Porvo, known to locals as Vana Porvo, you can see landmarks from the 13th century. Other great ways to pass the time in Porvo include touring the 11th century Porvo Cathedral, exploring local art and heritage at the Porvo Museum and indulging in delicious local. Its landmark is Porvo Cathedral, which is worth a visit. The Runeberg Home Museum in Porvo is the oldest home museum in Finland. It is House Museum of Finland's national poet Johann Ludwig Runeberg and his wife Friedrika Runeberg who lived there with their children. The museum's distinctive atmosphere is created by the furniture, artworks, and old houseplants which belong to the family. Frederica was a keen gardener, many of the plants here have been grown from cuttings of her original flowers, and in the summer guests can explore her restored garden. 5. Turku Along the coast of southern Finland is Turku, a city that served as the capital of Finland for much of the 19th century and is also believed to be the oldest in the nation. Although Helsinki has long since taken over as the capital, Turku is still a major destination in Finland, and it is home to countless historic attractions and cultural landmarks. Some of the top things to see in Turku include the 13th century Turku Castle, the twin museums called Boa Vitas and Ars Nova and the neighborhood of Luostarin Maki. A hugely significant building, this is the seat of the Archbishop of Finland and is the country's national sanctuary. Many people have this 13th century cathedral down as Finland's most important historic building. When it was first built the cathedral was made almost exclusively from wood, before a stone rebuild took place in the 1400s. Among the famous historical figures buried at Turku Cathedral is Karen Manstotter, the 16th century Queen of Sweden. 6. Finnish Lakeland as the name suggests, Finnish Lakeland is as area of Finland where there is an abundance of lakes. There are about 55,000 lakes here that are at least 200 meters, 660 feet, 
wide. The region is spread across central and eastern Finland. The largest lake in the district is Lake Saima, where you can swim, boat or just hike the perimeter and soak in the views. While in Finnish Lakeland, you can also explore the university town of Jyväskylä or the medieval St. Olaf's Castle. Located on the northwestern shore of Lake Saima, Mikali is an old garrison town, where you'll find sites related to the military and a good selection of holiday services. During the Winter War and the Continuation War the headquarters of the army was in Mikali. The history of that time is presented in the Headquarters Museum, Infantry Museum, and Communications Center Locky. In addition to those, you can also check out Monerheim Saloon Car. 7. Kemi Industrially, Kemi is a city in Finnish Lapland that is known best for its pulp mills. Travelers, however, know Kemi best as the location of the iconic snow castle. The castle is built yearly, and it can be three stories tall and serve as the venue for weddings and live musical performances. Guests can even stay overnight in the snow hotel, should they choose. Kemi also has a bustling nightlife scene, and the destination is where you can board the Arctic Icebreaker Tour. 8. Oland Archipelago In the heart of the Baltic Sea is a collection of islands known as the Oland Archipelago. While they technically do belong to Finland, the islands run relatively autonomously. Offering you the chance to see attractions like the ship-turned-museum called the Pommen, the Olin Maritime Museum, the 14th-century castle called Castellum and the miles of stunning hiking trails. Don't miss the culinary specialty of the archipelago, a dessert pancake topped with stewed plums and whipped cream. 9. Tampere Although it is the third-largest city in Finland, Tampere is still not a huge urban area, and it feels more like a collection of neighborhoods than a major metropolis. To get an understanding of Tampere's history and heritage, check out the Vapereki, a museum complex housing the Natural History Museum and the Finnish Hockey Hall of Fame. Outdoor recreation like skiing and hockey are incredibly popular in Tampere, but the less athletically inclined can settle for a stroll through outdoor hubs like Duck Park or the Haytenpa Arboretum. The popular Sarkanyami Adventure Park on the edge of downtown features an aquarium, a planetarium, a children's zoo, an art museum and an observation tower with great views of the forests and lakes. Ken Levi. With so much unspoiled landscape, Finland is a nature lover's dream destination. For outdoor enthusiasts, Winter Resort of Levi is undoubtedly a top pick for fun. Located in Finnish Lapland, Levi boasts miles of trails for skiing and snowboarding. There are also opportunities for more unusual activities such as reindeer safaris, ice fishing expeditions and relaxing in large outdoor saunas. The nightlife in Levi is a major draw for Finnish residents, so don't leave until you have explored the bars, lounges and clubs in central Levi. What do you think about our video? Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video make sure hit that like button. Also subscribe our channel before you go. Thank you for watching video.